If you scroll to the discovery section in Discord, you would find the servers with a little green icon. It is the verification badge. Now, I'm gonna explain what a verified Discord server is and how to get your server verified. Verified servers are communities run by businesses, brands, and figures of public interest. Now, if we scroll to the discovery section, we would find these servers with a green verification icon. As you can see, most of these servers are famous games, brands, or influencers, YouTubers, Twitch streamers, whatsoever. So that's a first note we could take. If you own a Discord server that's a well-known business, a brand, or even you're a public figure with a strong following you have a lot of followers you may qualify for the verification process but first you should know the requirements so to get your server verified you must be the owner of that server and an official representative of a business brand or public figure of public interest and you should authenticate any other relevant social media on your profile to help discord verify you and you should use a formal email address related to the brand business or entity or whatsoever and when discord evaluates your account they may also look at the authenticity so your community server represents a registered business brand or public figure and it must be original recognizable because discord says we look for a well-known business brands or individuals with a strong following so that's what you need to get verified and if you apply for it then you get accepted your server would get some cool perks like a vanity url invite splash background and the verified server badge but on your profile you're getting nothing there is no special badge or free nitro like a partnership program if you think that you're ready to get your server to the next level and get it verified, you will need to verify it. You will have to open this page, discord.com slash verification, then click on apply now button. Now, I need to have you focused a bit here. So as you can see, guys, this is the verification tab that appears to you after you click the button. So what type of server are you looking to verify? If it's a company, public figure, famous one, artist, open source project, esports, whatever. So for example, mine is public figure or personality. You click on next and then here you're going to type your personal information. As you can see, first name, it is Anixis. And then the second is AZNX. I'm not sure what's this, but anyway, entity name. So now I will have to type the business name. So for example, Anixis. And then your website. If you have a website, just type it here. For example, I would tap my YouTube channel youtube.com slash at annexes editor and then your title you can type your role or your rank whatever in the server but if you're an individual you don't need to type this because you're the one and then which server are you looking to verify so here you choose the server so for example so for example this is my server it's not but yeah share permanent invite link so you go to the server just like this invite people and then just edit invite and then select never generate a new link copy come back and paste it right here and then you will have to connect some accounts so twitch and then you connect it twitter reddit youtube whatever github and then click here and click on submit and this is it for now as you can see it gave me an error and i will explain why so the verification applications are now closed so we will need to wait a bit but i will make sure to inform you whenever they are open again so don't forget to subscribe to my channel a question that you may ask is which one is better verified servers or patented server to figure that out we should compare between server perks so when it comes to the server perks as you can see a vanity url they both get it yes yes invite splash they both get it voice quality only the partner program gets it stickers they both get it animated server icon only the partner program server banner partner they get everything almost the partner discord nitro for the owner partner gets verified does not verified badge on the server i mean this is stupid obviously only verified servers are going to get it and then partner badge on the server only the partnership is gonna get it and i'm gonna add something which is the partner program badge which appears in the owner's profile in addition to the requirements i explained before you will have to do some other steps so first thing first is to create some roles like moderators administrators and stuff so as you can see let me create administrator and yeah as you can see and you will have to add some safety for moderation so you go to server settings and then you scroll down to safety setup click on permissions and then you will have to enable this one so enable it and it requires you to type your multi-factor authentication so you click on back you'll have to set up auto mode dm and spam protection and rate protection and captcha as well you also need to set up the categories the channels and the stuff channels just make them private and set up the permissions and stuff so and the last thing you can do just come here and server settings and then scroll down and you will find default notification settings and set it to only mentions and actually you will need to set up the server and get it done look professional 
so they can accept you. This is so important to do, guys. So don't forget to do it. So if you get lucky enough and you get the verified badge, you may consider being active because Discord may remove the verification of your server. Because there are also some things you shouldn't do when you have a verified Discord server. So for example, not being active, transferring the ownership of the server to another one, to another person or user who is not officially affiliated with that business or brand or public figure, promoting hate or violence, insisting or engaging in harassment, selling or attempting to sell this verified server violence self-harm suicide and stuff so basically just engaging an activity that violates the discord's community guidelines or terms of service will get you losing the verified status so in general just do not break any discourse terms of service and you're fine so this was the video i hope you liked it guys if you did don't forget to like and subscribe and it would mean a lot and thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one goodbye